there's a trucker on the rock right there. Well, it appears Lady Luck is smiling on us right now because I found a Mylar balloon. We know what that means. Some of you might be saying, do we know what that means? It's good luck. Doyle, look. Doyle, look what I found. Look, see, it's a Mylar balloon. Yeah, we're gonna see some. He's got that look in his eye. If you follow the channel, you uh, might have a few questions from today's video. Uh, where is Reed? Uh, why are you hunting with his dog? Where is your dog? Uh, so let me break these down for you really quick. Reed is fishing of all things. Why would Reed be fishing when he could be chucker hunting? It is a solid question. He does have an excuse. Uh, he's been on the road for work a lot lately. And so he wanted to spend some time with his wife. And uh, believe it or not, she's not into chucker hunting. So. Uh, they decided to go fishing instead. Uh, why am I hunting with Reed's dog? And this one is sad for me. Um, my dog passed away, Tori. Uh, you've seen her in, in I think, every check hunting video up to this point. Um, she passed away this last summer, and uh, it, it's tough. It's so tough when you lose your hunting companion like that. And, you know, she had a great life, uh, you know, right until the end, and I spoiled the hell out of that dog her whole life. I was happy to see her grow into old age. So for those of you out there that have older dogs, um, you know, even not that old, you, you just never know. You've got to appreciate the moments out in the field with these dogs because, I mean, they're what makes the whole thing really possible. Doyle's gone rogue. Trust the dog or go where I heard him. Trust the dog. Oh. Good boy, Doyle. That was some subpar shooting, but I did get one. Good boy, Doyle. Oh, what a sequence. That was about 10 to 15 minutes of incredibly fast hiking. Oh, well, looks like Doyle might be on the bird. I'm gonna video this because I love videoing the dogs. But what a what a sequence! And we got our first bird of the day. So if you saw right there, I actually followed my own advice from one of our other videos. Uh, called Five Mistakes Chucker Hunters Make. If you haven't seen that video yet, I'll put a link above here. But uh, one of the common mistakes that, that people make when they're hunting these birds is they don't trust the dog, and I almost fell victim to it. I heard that bird up on the hill. I've been hearing him for 15 minutes while I walked up there. I was close the last time I heard him, and Doyle went down right before we got there, and I thought, Doyle must be on something else. This bird is right here. But I heard that little voice inside my head and I was like, you know, always trust the dog. That is always the best percentage. And lo and behold, it paid off. He took me right to him. And uh, I probably should have got more than one, but uh, I'm happy to get one. The great thing about dogs uh, is that when they're right and you're wrong, they never rub it in your face.
a little bit of a long shot there. Thanks for watching the video, guys. Unfortunately, we're only able to get one bird today, but you know, sometimes that's how it goes. Nobody really goes out and shoots a limited chucker every day. If they do, I wanna know where they're going. But we really appreciate you watching. If you liked the video, please hit the thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel. Thanks again for watching.